Hi everybody, I know I gave you an update uh, about Mumford's Magic not that long ago saying that we were happy with him, we were back on. Um, Paolo, actually our vet Paolo, had it in his notes that he had to rescan him. Uh, whilst the leg handles great and you'd be delighted um, with how it feels, he's very, very sound as well. On the scan, there is a small area of weakened fibre pattern. Now it's not, this isn't an, this isn't an injury but what it might be is a precursor to one. This might be nature just telling us to ease up. Now, Paolo has said rescan in two weeks and see where we are. Um, I know where we will be um, because a weakened area doesn't uh, strengthen in two weeks. It needs longer. Uh, my advice would be have the stumps up, um, give him plenty of time, have him back next year. He's been a horse that's I think like held his form well this year. I know he hasn't won, but he has held his form well. And in some better races... Uh, well, that better race at Sandown, I think we could have done things differently. Uh, he acquitted himself very well till uh, till the back of two out. And I think he's a horse that's, you know, a long way from showing us what he's actually capable of. Um, so I think it's prudent to give him the time and we'll have him back in the autumn. Obviously, we can start hurdling and then go chasing or go chasing straight away. Um, we know he's going to improve for a fence. So we've got all that to look forward to. I would be encouraging you all to... Sort of go down this road. Um, he's a horse that I don't think we've gotten to the bottom of anything like uh, his ability. Uh, so this is highly frustrating, um, but I think it gives the horse the best chance. And it's a definitive plan for all you guys to sort of understand and, and work with and, and know, number one, that you're doing the best for the horse. But number two, you're giving yourself the best sort of long term um, chance to, to get a good horse.